Hey everyone, check out these beautiful snowy sparkly winter nails. I'm going to show you how I did them so you can try them out for yourself at home. But first, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I have a ton of nail videos coming for you and you can let me know what you want to see next in the comments below. Now, let's get started. I'm going to start with this white beetles polish on my pinky, middle finger, and thumb. Then for my index finger and ring finger, I'm going to use this really pretty Kiara Sky Nude in the shade Bear With Me, probably my favorite nude I've ever tried. And as always, everything that I'm using, I will link in the description below. <laughs> I get any gel polish on my skin I take a flat brush and I use some rubbing alcohol to clean that up before I cure to avoid any gel allergies And of course, you're going to see my big ass head pop in and out of here because I love to get super close to get a good look at what I'm doing. I'm going to give them a 30 second cure. For the base of my chrome French tips, I'm going to use this D&D gel polish in the shade Bayberry. It's one of my favorite winter shades. To draw this French tip, I like to use a method which is basically just drawing an A on your nail and then filling it in until it looks like a French tip. <music> I clean up that C curve using the same cleanup brush and some rubbing alcohol. Now, I've always wanted to try out nail stamping and I finally got the chance because Maniology sent me the stamping kit. It's a wild heart stamping kit. It's one of the basically hundreds that they have on their website, but I really like this one because it had a bunch of intricate designs I knew I could never draw by hand. So in your nail stamping kit, you're going to receive two stamping plates with all the designs, a scraper, I'll show you how to use that in a minute, and these instructions with some stamping polish and a jelly stamper. I went with this little design that kind of looks like a snowflake and the blue stamping polish for that wintery look. And nail stamping is super easy. All you have to do is apply the polish to the design you want, use the scraper to scrape off that excess, and use the jelly stamper to pick up the design, and then just stamp it onto your nail. to pick up that excess polish on your nail or you can use rubbing alcohol it's up to you but I use rubbing alcohol in this instance if you want to get the stamping kit or any of Maniology stamping kits for yourself go ahead and use the link in my bio with code Lauren's nail for 10% off next I apply a matte top coat to all of my nails because it's time to chrome and fun fact when you use chrome having a matte top coat makes it easier for the chrome to stick where you want it to stick I'm going to start by making the snow using a dotting tool with that Bayberry polish and just kind of going to town creating little dots of snow and then I cure that and add some chrome powder. <laughs>
I was gonna stop there, but I can never leave well enough alone, and I wanted to add some nail bling, so I'm using this Beatles bling gel and a wax tool to apply some gems to my French tip nails. that a cure and a top coat and cure that too. Let me know if you like these nails in the comments below, give this video a like, and of course, subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching, I'll see you next time.